<laughs> hey guys, I'm Cameron and welcome to the latest episode of The Mailbag. If you've never seen this show before, this is where I take some of your uh, comments from the last uh, month or so of uh, Man on Fire videos and I talk about them and answer them. Um, <clears throat> so, uh, let's get right into it. The first comment comes from um, the episode of Anime Duo where we talked about the anime Tokyo Ghoul. Uh, this is from Dylan Ross. He says, personally, I didn't like the beginning of this anime at all. The only reason I kept watching it was because a friend who knew I would want to talk about it uh, recommended it to me. However, the show started to get much better after the first couple of episodes and I ended up lo loving the anime. Sorry, if you've not seen the show before, you don't know that I can't read. Um, yeah, we get a lot of comments like this on Anime Duo um, and thankfully Dylan Ross has you know, kind of understood that we do watch the first couple of episodes we don't watch much further usually. Um, this is because we like to give our first impressions, and um, yeah, I think it's it's a good comment because he does agree with us, you know, that the beginning of the anime wasn't the best. But um, like a lot of animes we watch, um, people say, you know, we should keep watching and we should, you know, um, uh, it, that it gets better. And that is cool. I'm glad that it gets better because I was interested in a lot of the concept in uh, uh, concepts in uh, Tokyo Ghoul. It was just a bit of a bummer that they didn't put more effort into the first couple of episodes. Um, so the next comment uh, comes from Happy Wheels Replay Showcase, episode 59. Um, this is from Zach Zu... Zu oh, I'm so sorry, I can't pronounce your name. Zach Z Zu... Is it more offensive to attempt and get it wrong or to just say, no, I'm not going to try? I'm going to attempt. I think that, you know, you got to go all, all in. Um, Zach Zura Whiskey. Zach Zero Whiskey. Maybe. I'm sorry if I got your name wrong. Anyway, <clears throat> he says, Hey guys, I'm Z Man Gamers123. Awesome. This is the guy, if you don't watch Happy Wheels uh, Replay Showcase, he's the guy that sent in basically so many replays that we had no excuse but to bring the show back. Like, we had to bring it back because of how many replays he sent in. He says, um, I've, been, I've been kind of off Happy Wheels for a long time, but I will be back... Uh, after my vacation, two weeks. Also, thanks for the extra replay. I feel so special. Um, now, you can take off as much time as you want, bro, because you sent in so many replays. We're going to be showing them for a while. I mean, like, and his, all his replays are, like, really good as well. It's not like he sent in a bunch of, like, generic replays. Like, they're all real funny. So, um, thanks for sending all those in. We've thanked you on the show, but I just want to thank you personally because you basically brought back the show. I mean, we, we love all the replays and submissions we get. Um, we get a lot of submissions now, but um, because of Z-Man Games 123 sending in all those replays, we were kind of like, it kind of kicked us in the ass. We were like, all right, people want this show back. Um, so the third comment comes from um, Over Overgrowth Versus, episode one, with me and Jack, me and Jack Morris. Sorry, guys. Um, he's, uh, it's from uh, Nofuku Fudgy, maybe? Yeah, I think that's his name. Nofuku Fudgy. No, no, no Fuku Fudgy says, outros are a thing now, question um, mark? He's actually referring to, at the end of that episode, we played one of our kind of experimental outros that we were trying. Um, no, those outros aren't a thing now. They, we were just trying them out. They were fun, and we enjoyed filming them, and um, they turned out pretty funny. Um, there's a couple of them. I don't know if you guys will see them. Maybe you will. But um, we tried them out. We aren't very happy with them. We, we like where they're going. Um, but we're going to try and uh, explain, um, experiment and change and then see where we can go. But yeah, we're trying to um, do something different for the outros. Uh, if you guys have any opinions on what you thought of that intro that play, played um, in episode 1 of Overgrowth Versus, just go to the video and comment below and say like whether you like the outro and what you think we could change about it. Because we're always looking for new ideas for outros. Keep, you know, changing, upgrading, better and bettering ourselves. Um, so this next comment is on uh, the Manifier Films podcast uh, 96, which is the first part of the Comic-Con podcast that we did. The second part uh, is going out tomorrow, I believe. Um, this is from Mr. Pineapple. He says, I do love you guys. I, and then smiley face. But no, that's a really nice thing to say. And as Jack has mentioned before on the show, flattery will get you into the show. But uh, I just wanted to focus on that guy's profile picture because it's so cute. Like, I can, I can picture that pineapple being like, I do love you guys, eh? So, yeah, that's, that's what I, I like to put that. Speaking of the podcast, on both episode um, 
97 and 96. I got a bunch of comments saying Reign of Blood. I don't know what that means, but I feel like Jack Morris was behind it. So if someone could comment below telling me why we got a bunch of comments saying Reign of Blood, that would be great because I'm very scared. Um, this next comment comes from Tori, Tori Bash Replay um, uh, Challenge 6. Tori Bash Replay? I, I think I fucked this one up. It comes from Tori Bash Replay... <laughs> Tori Bash Replay Challenge Episode 6? Is that right? Look, it comes from Tori Bash Replay Showcase Challenge. Tori Bash Replay... Oh my gosh, okay. I'm not going to cut this out because I want you guys to see how much I can't speak. Um, this comes from Tori Bash Replay, Show uh, Replay Challenge. Oh, I can't say this word. Alright, but anyway, it comes from an episode of Tori Bash Replay Challenge. And, um... <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I just... I'm so tired. This episode's going out late, and I'm sorry. And the light is dying, so I don't have much time, so I'm rushing this. Um, so, Squidlocks says, You should play Realm of the Mad God for a Misery Mondays-esque thing. Now, um, what he's implying... What he's, um... I assume he's uh, referring to is the fact that Misery Mondays isn't a thing anymore. It's kind of on a hiatus. Uh, we're trying to reinvent it and bring it back as something else. But before we do, if you want us to play any games, there's a good chance that we'll play them if you go uh, over to our other channel, Arcade Crowd, and kind of comment below saying, you know, I want you to play this game because that channel's just started up. Um, we've got a ton of videos on there now, and we kind of burn through videos real fast because. We do 10-minute um, episodes, and we put out um, usually, like, two parts of a game, like, every week. It's kind of complicated, but depending on how many parts, we'll get through a game real fast. Um, so we're playing a lot of different uh, video games, um, and it's causing us, like, to really go into, like, all the suggestions we've got from fans. Like, uh, we've played some games that we would never even have considered to Let's Play, but because people have asked us to Let's Play them, we've gone on and Let's Played them, and it's turned out really fun. And if the game is, like, you know, if you want to make Jack mad with this game, because it's real hard, I'm sure it'll play it on Arcade Crowd, because people love seeing Jack get mad. And um, we can also, like, with Arcade Crowd, we edit the videos a lot. Um, so we can even, like, put a little mad Jack floating around in the screen be fun. But yeah, um, so if you wanted to play any video games um, that aren't like, you know, the that aren't involved in shows that we do, or if you want us to do like, um, you know, a Let's Play that you don't think will last more than one episode, I recommend going to Arcade Crowd, commenting on those videos, sending us a message, you know, saying, you know, I want you to um, um, play, uh, play this game on Arcade Crowd, because it's good fun. And go subscribe if you enjoy it. <laughs> um, so this comment comes from Besiege Spotlight, uh, Watercopter, and M M M M Matilda? Matilda Mark II? I guess that was one of the creations. Um, British Production says, I like the co-host. Well, thank you. Oh, wait, I like co-host. Oh, he's just referring to the idea of co-host. No, yeah, that's fine. I was the co-host in the other episode. Um, we didn't think it worked very well, but people seem to be liking it. So we're going to tweak it and see if we can figure out how to do a co-host. We might end up having a co-host all, all the time. Maybe it'll be a kind of, like, special thing. But, yeah, we've we've definitely taken in the feedback that people have been saying how they enjoy the, um, the co-host in the uh, Besiege Spotlight show. Okay, so, um... This comment comes from Happy Wheels Replay Showcase, episode 132. Um, and it's from um, Rez, RezcoX. Um, and he just said, Just filled out the form, Jack. Hope it helps. P.S. I love the new channel. Now, the form he's referring to is, um, we set up a form for all of the people who watch our videos to kind of go and kind of say what they like, what they don't like, what they want from us, you know, how long they've been viewing. It just helps us improve the channel and kind of uh, cater to your wants. You know, we get a lot of requests coming in from all the different angles. Um, and it's just an easier way to kind of streamline everything and see what the see what everyone wants so we can please everyone, you know. Um, so if you want to go um, fill out that survey, I'm sure I can link to it in the description. Or if not, um, you can go to the video that he commented on, which is Tori Bash Replay Showcase Episode 132. Um, and it'll be in the description of that. But yeah, um, it was really helpful. Thank you for filling that out. Um, 
Rexco, and also he said love the new channel, which of course he's referring to Arcade Crowd. Thank you, because we love the new channel too. It's super fun to do. Um, this comment comes from Tari Bash Replay Showcase 132 as well. It's the same, um, same episode. And this was from Carl Nelson, or Nielsen. And he says, this channel deserves a lot more credit and subscribers. Thank you, bro. Thanks. It's always nice to see comments like that, because you get a lot of times where people, you know, are commenting like first, or... Um, they just comment in requests, which is completely fine and just, um, it's not a lot that people take their time, you know, even if you enjoy a video, like, think of how many videos you watch, you enjoy, and then you never leave a comment saying that you enjoyed them because you just kind of take it for granted. So it's always nice when people, you know, let us know how much they appreciate our videos. Um, but yeah, if, I mean, you say we deserve a lot more credit and subscribers, but just, you know, having you guys watch us all the time and comment below is... It's just good enough, really. I mean, we, we'd love more subscribers and more credit, but, like, just just know that the, the, your comments of, like, appreciation um, are really nice. They really are. And uh, I, I wouldn't trade the world for it. Um, <laughs> this is from Gary's Mod Spotlight, Dubstep Guns. This is the last comment. Um, it's from AHS Valor, a.k.a. Val. And he says, I want myself too hard. I'm gonna need a towel well on that note I think I'm gonna have to say goodbye because uh, that made me uncomfortable but uh, thanks for all the comments um, we've been getting a lot more comments recently um, just a surge of people just trying to make conversation and stuff and I always enjoy that you know um, I love comments more than anything because it's it's like you see the number going up you see the subscriber number going up or the like counter going up and it's like oh people like us but you don't really get as personal as someone actually commenting below and saying you know I like this I want you guys to do this you know you know this video is my favorite this is what I don't like you know um, the video stopped then automatically but anyway thanks for everything and uh, I shall see you next time